It's very hard when I have war in your country. It's like a, a dream or is a not a good dream. Before 10 years, we had a good life. We never, never, never had think to go outside Syria. My heart is very hard, but I tried my best to just explain to my children, always talk about Syria before the war. I remember when I was a child, I was a play here. It's my school, it's my work. We have uh, like a car dealership and a sweets factory. And when the war starts, it's very hard, very dangerous. And I lost everything. First we were in Syria, then when the bomb came on our house, my dad, he got our car and started driving, so then they stopped us. They said, give us the car and we'll let you go. We gave them the car and they let us go. when my husband just turned on the TV to see news. Please stop, please, I can't. I know it's hard because I know what's happened in Syria. Inside the war, how many people need food, how many people need home, how many people, their children, they lose their parents. We are still human. It's very important to support people for the children, for their life, their future. So when I first came to school, lots of people in my school were Syrian and knew how to speak Arabic. So they came to me and were like, here, I'll show you around and everything. I had lots of, lots of friends. Because when I first came to Canada, I'm like, I'm different. Now I fit in.